Oh, cool. What's this? Looks like a bunch of dead CPUs. You know what? Come to think of it, why don't I show you how to turn your old dead processors back into new, working, faster performing processors? It's actually not talked about too much, but it's quite simple. I'll show you the process right here. We'll grab all the CPUs, uh, just dump them into a can, put them on the stove, turn the stove up. Okay, so while it's cooking, I've printed off a spec sheet for the new Ryzen processor. Uh, I, I believe you can find this directly from AMD. You might need to ask them for it. Uh, and then you'll need to cut out one of the one of the wafer spec sheets. Once you have it cut out, you'll need to get a piece of cardboard or something similar to uh, surround it with. Uh, this is just to keep it in place. If we go back to our stove, it looks like our processor soup is about ready. A lot of new transistors in there. Now what we'll do is we'll pour it over the diagram. Uh, what ends up happening is that there's this sort of transistor goop that you get. It might be a little bit unbelievable, but as that goop goes over the, the paper, there are ridges formed over the ink. Very, very tiny ridges. It happens very quickly, and in an instant, it's pretty much done. Now, you'll have to cut the wafer up into the size of the processor die that you want. I'll just do it freehand because I know what I'm doing. And once you have it the right size, and you'll see it's about the right size, it doesn't have to be perfect because you'll see in this next step we take our trusty old heat gun put it over the new die and with a little bit of time it will integrate with the old die as soon as that's done you can put the processor cover back on uh, put it on tightly while it's still warm so you will it will stick together and with that you have a brand new processor it doesn't really matter the form factor that you get your new processor is an AMD Ryzen. Well, unfortunately, I don't have a motherboard to test this processor with, uh, so I wish I could show you some benchmarks, but I can't. Anyway, I do hope you did learn something new. If you did, please press that like button. If you didn't, dislike. Otherwise, have a good day, have a good night, have a good morning. Bye-bye.